Hey guys, what's up? It's McNeil from uh, Lewison Automotive. And today, in today's video, from start to finish, I'm gonna try to see if I can show you guys how we rehab our vehicles. So uh, we're gonna start with this 2017 Ram uh, that I got. In this video, we're gonna show you all the imperfections that we found. We're gonna show you how we fix those vehicles and uh, the end result of that vehicle ready for sale. So in one video, we're gonna try to capture everything, complete rehab. So uh, hang in there. I hope you appreciate the effort. I hope you appreciate the work. Uh, give us a thumbs up. And uh, I always have to tell you to do it so you can remember to do it. Uh, and then uh, we can uh, keep pushing those videos. So let's uh, get into it. <music> My name is McNeil and I'm the owner of Lewis Narco. So first and foremost, some of the things that are the easiest is some of the cosmetic stuff that we can see here. So in this Ram truck, uh, on the tunnel cover, you can see rips on it. Now, uh, tunnel cover is very expensive. Uh, we do not want to replace that cover because if we replace the cover, that's more capital that we have to put into the truck that we may not necessarily get out. We want to maximize the profit. Now, the tunnel cover is still usable, so I'm not going to throw it away and buy another one. I'm just going to use some tape. I would suggest don't go cheap on this. It's your life that's at stake, so use a handyman secret weapon, duct tape. So we're gonna duct tape the shit out of it, okay? Now this is a black duct tape, so it's just gonna look same like the tunnel cover. I'm just gonna put some tape over most of the holes as best as I can, and then hope for a nice clean finish. Now when I walk around the truck, some of the obvious things was the tires in the front needed to be replaced. Uh, it looks like maybe those were the back tires before and they probably were just rotated, uh, but two of the tires look kind of, um, uh, well, it's going to fail safety, put it that way. So uh, instead of ordering four new tires, I'm just going to put two tires on this truck because that's all it needs. Now, I do not normally put used tires on my vehicles. There is no point of putting a used tire on it. Like, like it, it just sells better if I tell a guy I got new tires in the truck versus uh, picking up some used tires somewhere else. Talking about tires, quick plug, go to louisa.ca and you can buy your rims and tires there. Keep in mind, we do ship into your house, so you do not have to be within our postal code to order from us. Go ahead and order uh, louisa.ca rims and tires. So I'm gonna order two tires. I'm gonna put it on the truck uh, right now. So. So yeah, so now we got our four uh, tires installed because two were good and the other ones are fine. We'll do a rotation if we have to. Now we did uh, a brake inspection. Looking at the brakes on this vehicle, there is a pulsation on the front. Like when I hit the brake, I can feel the pedal pulls in and I can feel the steering shake into it. I mean, both the front pad and rotor is gonna have to replace all around. So we're gonna do a complete brake job on this truck. In the back of the brake rotors, uh, there is parking shoes in there. Now, the sad thing is, it's a massive job to do that. You gotta remove the axle shafts, you gotta move, uh, the, open up the diff, drain the fluid. So a lot of people just don't change the shoes when it needs to be. In my truck, uh, when I hit the parking brake, it's dead. That means somebody went in there and took all the shoes off or disable it. So uh, I'm not gonna sell a truck that way, I'm gonna put the shoes in. If you guys have trucks and you wanna put your shoes on, cause a lot of guys don't wanna do it, you can come see us. It's normally about a six hour job and I'll make a detailed video showing you why shops will charge you up to six hours on that. So hang in there. If I already made the video, I'll put a link up here for it. If not, it's gonna be in the future. So subscribe, like, share, you'll see that video later. Now we're gonna re put some fresh diff oil in there. We're gonna put new shoes and everything 
and go for a test drive and see if the truck need anything else. But as per our inspection, that's all we need right now. I looked at the oil, it did not look too bad. I look at the oil change sticker inside of the truck. It looks like it's supposed to be changed at uh, 186,000 kilometers based on the last oil change, uh, but an oil light already came on the truck. It just means that when they change this oil and put that sticker in it, they probably did not reset the oil light. I mean, an oil change is not too expensive. I'm gonna go ahead and do a fresh oil change regardless, change the sticker in here and reset the light. So, uh, so far what we've done, oil change, pad and rotors all around, parking shoes, two new tires, and of course I gotta throw in the Louisa wipers on there. And again, wipers are available on our website, louisa.ca. After that, I'm gonna send the truck out for a full detail and we're gonna go ahead and uh, clean the truck just so that it can be ready for pictures. Now in cleaning the truck, if you look closely, there is a lot of imperfections on the truck, little dings and dangs and bang, bang. It was a construction truck. I am not gonna paint the entire truck. I'm not gonna spend money on that. That's a waste of money on this cosmetic shit. However, on the staircase, you can see that there's rust on the stairs. So stuff like that, I'm gonna just use some black paint and touch that shit up so it looks decent. I am not going to bother uh, repaint the entire thing, just a little touch up so it looks a little bit better in the pictures. Underneath the truck look beautiful. There's no oil leaks or no nothing like that. And just like that, guys, our truck is ready for sale. So we're gonna take some pictures. I'm gonna give you a quick walk around and uh, don't forget to subscribe, like, share. I catch you in the next one. Peace. Okay, so this is gonna be a quick walk around of the end result of the Dodge Ram. So first I'm gonna give you a quick walk with the doors open. See how clean this is. It's hanging there. You're gonna see it all. Okay, let's get it into the back seat. We do have good weatherproof mats in the front and back have that pass-through window here navigation Let's take a look this way and just a quick reminder so we did do two new tires in the front we did do pad and rotors all around let me show you here and also the parking brake. A lot of guys skip the parking brake because of the amount of work it takes. But we did the parking brake for you as well on this. Fresh oil change, nicely cleaned, ready for sale. 2017 Ram, 1500 sports package. Power mirrors power windows, heated mirrors, 180K on the clock right now, navigation, backup camera, upgraded sound system, heated seats and steering. Plug. This car is ready for sale. All done. If you want to buy this car, give us a call. 416-241-1862. Hit us up. We'll make it happen.